James has the task to deliver all core enterprise apps from the cloud without being locked down to a single vendor, but he isn't sure how to do that. His current application delivery architecture is all around the ADC, which happens to be Netscaler. He decides to explore the Citrix Hybrid Cloud application delivery solution, which acts like a central brain and can deliver applications hosted in a combination of on-prem, public, and private cloud environments. It can also distribute the load to each location. It can enable features like auto-scaling based on traffic volume and cloud bursting, that is, enabling traffic to additional locations as needed in order to handle a surge in demand. It also handles cloud failover and disaster recovery in the event of an outage, all while ensuring that each client goes to their geographically designated nearest location for the best experience. The central brain can authenticate users with an on-prem Active Directory server and distribute traffic across clouds using cookies to provide authentication for application-specific access. It takes care of expanding requirements with auto-provisioning of resources. Licensing is centralized and controlled and is based on subscription and consumption. Through the solution, James can manage his on-prem, public, and private cloud inventory through a single dashboard and his SSL certificates can also be managed centrally for each location in the cloud. Connecting to enterprise stacks like Cisco ACI, VMware NSX, OpenStack, and Google Kubernetes, orchestration is simplified with this integrated solution. It also automates deployments with CloudFormation templates in AWS and Terraform templates for multiple device stacks. Stylebooks and modules for Ansible can be used for automating tasks. The central brain also works with external third-party solutions like ServiceNow and SSL Labs. Finally, this brain is the one-stop analytics solution helping James to oversee the complete infrastructure and the applications delivered with it. It also helps to forecast the need for deployment changes by automating calculation tasks, such as when the infrastructure should scale up to handle peak demand, when the common peak usage time is for an application, when a certain deployment or application can be taken offline or failed over for maintenance, and when a particular server is slowing down, showing James how to and when to take it out of the production workflow.